Okay, so here's a problem you sent me, and I looked at your homework. It looks like you answered everything, but you're having a little trouble with the graph, and I'm not really sure what, what's going on here. Um, it looks like every time you're just slightly off. Um, so here's a similar example to the one that you have right here. The only difference is it's going to be a 7. So that's going to be a vertical shift of 7. So when I click here to do this, you click the logarithm graph right here and click anywhere on the graph and so it populates right here so you can see it's base three so don't mess with that i don't know if that's what is causing the issue i'm really not sure but here's your uh vertical shift so i'm going up by a positive four um seven i'm sorry so I, i'll put seven enter and see how it pops up seven there is no horizontal shift don't worry about the shrinking and stretching we're not going to have any of that and then don't have any reflections for this particular one, but I don't know why, from what I can tell on your graphs, you're just always a, a tick too high or low, and I'm not really sure why. So I'm going to go ahead and save that and then check my answer. Okay, now it looks like I'm having the same issue you had. Let's, oh, you know what? I didn't put my... Uh, my asymptote. So let's go ahead and save that now. And now try it. And that looks good. And I believe you had yours on there. Yeah, you had your asymptote. So I'm not really sure what the deal was on that. But hopefully that will clarify any confusion.